Hi, I am Dr. Ananta Krishna. I am a practicing surgical gastroenterologist at Nano Hospitals Uttaralli. The gallbladder is a small pouch like organ that is located just beneath the liver. So this gallbladder has the function of storing bile juice which is secreted from the liver. It has to release this bile juice when there is food inside the intestine. So whenever there is some abnormality of the function of this gallbladder, then the bile juice that is there inside the gallbladder will get hardened and there will be precipitates that form inside the gallbladder which are called as gallbladder stones. So what are the main problems with these gallbladder stones? The patients can complain commonly of dyspepsia that means indigestion. They can also have some heaviness and bloated sensation after meals and sometimes these stones can get complicated wherein they block the gallbladder's outlet tube causing what we call as a mucosine of the gallbladder or these stones can even block the bile tube that runs from the liver to the intestine. So at that point of time, the patients can get jaundice or they may end up in further complications called as pancreatitis also. So this needs to be diagnosed and treated whenever symptomatic. So we categorize these stones into few categories wherein first is a asymptomatic gallstone. That is when we have done a routine scan for a patient during an annual health checkup and that is when we have found out the gallbladder stone. So do we need to treat that? Probably no because he is asymptomatic. In asymptomatic gallstone disease, we generally do not offer surgery. We just advise the patients to be on a healthy diet. Though this healthy diet will not cure them of the gallbladder stones, we wait for them to develop any symptoms because the symptoms develop in only about 30% of the patients. The remaining 70% of them can have stones without any symptoms for their entire life. So in those patients in the next category who have become symptomatic with dyspepsia or they can be having bloated sensation after meals or they can be having aversion to eating any oily meals in such patients we do advise treatment so what is the treatment in these category of patients it is done with a simple treatment called as laparoscopic cholecystectomy wherein we make a few small holes in your abdomen and we remove the gallbladder in its entirety along with the stones. So does this surgery have any side effects or complications? It does not have any major side effects. So the gallbladder was initially not functional. So we have removed an organ which was already not functional. So it does not cause any problem to the patient. Coming to the complications, yes, complications are known with this surgery also as with any other surgery. And these complications are very, very rare in about 0.5% of the surgeries as in if I have operated 1000 cases of laparoscopic cholecystectomy, maybe in about 3 or 4 of them, we might anticipate some complications. And these are also treatable complications. So in such scenarios where the gallstone has slipped into the bile tube, it becomes more and more complicated. So we initially have to do a procedure called as ERCP. That means during an endoscope, we pass a wire into the bile tube and remove the stone. After removal of the stone, then again the cholecystectomy has to be performed. So this is a complicated scenario. Better advisable would be do not wait for the complications to occur. Whenever the person is symptomatic, then it is better to get rid of this gallbladder problem.